Welcome to Utex VB tutorial series. In this video, we are going to see how to create a data report and how to create a crystal report connection from VB to show the registration details of the students. The source code is available at etechsolutions.com slash projects slash vb6 underscore print dot rar. Please subscribe for more videos. Let us start with the coding. This is a registration form. We have created a registration form, login form, and a far, far screen and a main screen. The login form and registration form are already covered in the last video. So we will discuss in about board generation and printing of the registration form using VB data report in this video. This is a registration form. In this registration form, we are adding the photos and registration details of the students. We have a search button to search the details. And in this video, we are going to discuss about the printing of the registration form, including photos. And getting the student list using crystal report 10. Let us start with the registration form printing. The registration form printing, first we have to select the record. Set the record and print it to the data report. In the print command, First, we have to select the registration ID. Registration ID is already getting selected when we are loading the searching and loading the record. On the search command, we will be loading the selecting the record using the registration ID, and that registration ID is stored in the reg label reg id dot caption so after loading the record we will be printing that one we will just show the coding later it's a registration form we are setting the record search any record search it double click it to open it and print to show that record in the data report form let us go with the coding side On the print command, we are loading the registration ID and we have created a RS items record set. We have declared it, it, the record set here and with the loading the details to the record set. The record set is created with the create records function. We will go to the create record function at the bottom. In the create record function, we have declared the record set fields and its type and loaded the data to the record set. Selecting the registration table with the registration ID is equal to whatever registration ID we have selected and loading the details to the record set. So, after loading the record set, we are loading these details to the crystal report, uh, data report fields. The data report is created with the data report. We have already created a data report, member report. This is our data report. In this data report, we have a heading and a student name and registration number, name. Field names are label reg number. Label as name, father name, mother name, date of birth address, remarks, and 
phone number and the photo that is image 2. These are the controls available in the uh, data report. You will be loading to the these controls, loading the data from, to these controls from the print button command. In this said section 4 controls the label headings we are loading the student bio data that is a fixed one in the label name caption we are loading the student name and the label registration number loading the registration number and student name is already loaded in the label s name caption also and father label f name that is father name we are loading the father name these variables are here declared here and mother name we are loading the mother name and the photo if the photo is available we are loading the photo from the image directory and the photo name is rs done rs as photo the, which is available in the image directory so we are loading the photo from the image directory which name is we are already saved in the table so we will be loading this photo to the screen and just lastly we are showing the record on the complete details on the data report so this is all for the printing of the registration form let us run and see it's ready password here registration select any previous registration load it and print so the details are loaded to the data report here and the other the next one is we are going for a student list the student list we are loading the data to the crystal report from the query let us go with the coding side the main form student list first you are declaring the crystal report for control here opening is checking the connection is already opened or not if it is open it will just close the connection and reopen the connection using the parameters like user id uh, like password and the odbc name the odbc we are already created in the control panel go to the control panel system and security odbc the ODBC, the system DSN side, it created CR report to ODBC. Just that ODBC is connected with the BB CR10 project directory data folder DB1. So DB1 and the is the database we are using. So the connection is ODBC connection is given to that database. The connection is opened here and if the connection is null database connection is null again we are opening with this direct data connection and the my report is a variable the my report is a string where we are storing the student list as a string and for printing purpose we are checking that student list select the case my report is if it is student list then select the star from registration table and load it to the student list view so if the in the this portion we are deleting the student list view if the student list view is already available and later we are loading the student list view that is select star from registration to this view student list view and assigning the student list view to student report uh, report file that is available in the report folder we will just open the report file here this is the report file in the report file we have the student list that is a uh, heading and pa parameters are available here the registration number student name father name mother name etc are available here we are loading the values to the student list and this connection is CR report that is ODBC connection and the 
student list is the is the view we are created in the database. So these are the first report. This is how you are loading the data to the first report. Here is the output. If the output is going to the screen, that means we are showing the output to the screen or output to the printer. Let us run, run the project. The student registration search item we are getting the output and the student list form we are getting the output to the screen that is the student list the source code is available at triple tech solutions dot com slash project slash Source code is available at www.tripletechsolutions.com slash project slash vb6 underscore print dot drive or you can mail it at global at yahoo.com for more details. These are for this project. For more videos, just subscribe my channel. Thank you. Have a nice day.